It's up here this morning, scattered debris still lying parts of a downtown Tampa street this morning after flames ripped through a restaurant. ABC Action News reporter Vanessa Ariza is live along Franklin Street right now. Vanessa, is that scene clear yet? Not exactly. Good morning to you, Dee and James. There's still a Tampa police officer that's blocking part of Franklin Street. Take a closer look here. You can see a fire truck in front of that business here. Even 10 hours after that fire first began, that fire starting at the Sichuan restaurant on Franklin Street. Now, this is what firefighters arrived to around 6 o'clock last night. Investigators, they will try to pinpoint a cause as soon as it's safe to get inside of that building. Now, because that building here is so close to everything else, they evacuated the entire block. We had a chance to speak with one man who says he actually helped one person get out. Pulled him out, um, peeked in just to see if there was other individuals in because I didn't see anybody and the smoke was massive. I pulled myself out, uh, got the individual under control and the fire uh, department came and took over. The good news here, no one was seriously hurt. That man who was uh, taken out of the building, was treated for minor injuries. We're also told that a firefighter was treated for minor injuries. Both of those people expected to be okay this morning, but the investigation into this fire continues. Now, coming up within the next 30 minutes, we'll share with you the one thing that may have actually helped fire crews battle the flames last night. But for now, we are live in downtown Tampa. Vanessa Ariza, ABC Action News. Thank